What's up, guys? C12 Designs here, bringing you a uh, commentary on no gameplay. But, uh, yeah, just talking about what I like about CSGO, what I don't, and what I don't like about CSGO, and problems that I've had with it. The problem, I have, had, I have two problems. Well, I had one, and now I still have another problem, so basically two problems. Okay, whatever. Uh, my first problem was that I had 9 FPS constant on every single setting you can possibly put it on from lowest to highest medium like between low and medium all the way low okay I had 9 FPS period then typed it on Google um, CSGO FPS problems and a YouTube link popped up of a guy that posted a video of an AMD FX low FPS fix CSGO I'm like wow this guy is amazing he literally hit, he hit the, I don't even know what the fuck that metaphor is called, but whatever, he hit it, he hit the spot, that sounded gay, but whatever, I'm not gonna stop this commentary, I'm just gonna keep on going, okay, he had a program that you download, which is right here, all these three things here come in a RAR file, you open this up, you, um, well it's already running as admin, it's, asks you yeah to make changes to your computer yes everything loads up like a little text thing you close the you <coughs> close a window open up CSGO and your FPS problem is fixed so um it's amazing I fixed it I now have a hundred uh, FPS on highest settings high my native resolution which is 366 by 768 366 1366 by 768 and highest settings on everything aspect ratio 16 by 9 everything everything on high and now I get a hundred constant um, and I'm good and now a problem that I still have now when I record a demo and I open in demo e or whatever the hell it's called it'll be fine at first and then when I when then at the beginning of the next round after I die uh, it will be it, like it's gray, black and white, and when you start off before the actual game starts, like always, and then when the round starts, it'll immediately get black and white, and it'll get super duper blurry, so you can barely see anything, and it's like that from the whole entire demo. I don't know how to fix it. That's why there hasn't been CS:GO gameplay on my channel, but yeah, that that's the whole entire problem. I don't know what's going on with that and yeah so that's that's the only two problems I have with the game what I don't like about the game purely you cannot adjust your crosshairs you have the gay crosshairs that the game comes with you can put it on dynamic or static static it doesn't move dynamic it does but still when you put it on default crosshair settings and it's just those four lines those that's that's still too big i cannot snipe with an ak across the map like that or a, or a deagle because for me i need the middle of the crosshair to be the size of their head to be able to snipe with an ak or deagle or m4 or whatever but with uh, nah it's just too big <sighs> excuse me it's just too big i don't like it um but anyways those are the only things i don't like about the game other than the fact it kind of looks like call of duty graphics but that's just me um the everything else i like it i still like source better i think source is still a better game but when counter strike source first came out it sucked fat dick and then it, they kept on patching it and patching it and still updating it they still update source so i believe that csgo will get to as good as how source is someday how long has been has source been out i don't even know like 10 years 12 years i don't even know or is that was that 1.6? <coughs> <coughs> oh, sorry. Oh, God. <coughs> oh, Jesus Christ. No, I'm not choking on dick, so I don't even say it. <laughs> so, anyways. I like the game. I like everything about it, other than what I already said I don't like about it. And it's just minor details that I, that I have problems with. I only have one problem, and it's the demo recording. But I'm pretty sure that that will be fixed in the actual game. Oh my god, another thing I don't like about uh, CSGO. Character models suck. You can't tell who 
who's on your team. And on top of that, you have a whole bunch of new fags. I'm a new fag in the CSGO beta. And they don't know who's who in the character models. And on top of that, you put friendly fire on. Dude, you're just asking for TKs left and right. Honestly. But, yeah. Um, I really want to scream on that game. But I don't have a server. And I'm not buying ESCA subscription. So, yeah. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, if I was able to put CSGO, um, gameplay up, I really would. I'm gonna keep on trying to, uh, get gameplay up, but I do as I can. So, yeah, guys, this is C12 Designs, and I'm out. Peace. What's up, guys? I'm back again to, uh, two videos in one. Um, I'm gonna show you how to put an auto exec in your um what do you call this in your csgo thing in your csgo uh file or whatever okay i'm only doing it for my type of computer 64 bit and windows 7 i don't know anything else so what you want to do i use windows explorer i just scroll down go to your c drive programs files 86 at x86 whatever obviously steam steam apps and then you want to go all the way down to common I know you would think it would be under your steam name but it's not I don't know why you click common global offensive beta well it's kinda of try global offensive it doesn't say beta whatever you r double click that's to launch it I don't know what the hell this thing is obviously this is DirectX installer but whatever um, you click CSGO as you would C strike in the counter strike source thing and then you click CFG and then you just drag your auto exec in there I'm not gonna do that due to the fact that I already have mine in there if you guys want my settings I, well if you guys want my auto exec I'll put it in the description also but yeah um, I will show you what my auto exec looks right now okay I uh, drag that in there um yeah I don't know if these CL underscore commands work on CSGO I know the CL underscore ragdoll underscore physics definitely doesn't work. I don't like that because I, I don't like like dead bodies all over the floor and stuff. No, it's not because I'm scared of it or anything. I, I just love it when I kill them. How they just like, it looks like they evaporate and they just like, they, they just, it just, it looks like they evaporate. But anyways, uh, yes, you can change your FOV in CSGO. People who say you can't, they're liars. But um, this is my old CFG. Um, CL underscore show FPS space one does not work um, for auto exec, so I just use here. Let me change it. Net, no, not net. Yeah, net. What the fuck? <laughs> net underscore graph space one. Obviously, want to turn it on, and then. I don't like it at the bottom right of my screen because it gets in the way of my ammo counter. That's just me. So for me, I put net underscore graph height 700. And that's at the top right for me. Play around with the numbers to find out where you want it. I don't know if it goes, if the higher you go in the numbers, if it moves it to the left. I don't know. That's, I, I just don't know. But I know 700 puts it at the top right for me. So uh, that that's just me. So, my auto exec will be in the description, and yeah, guys, this is all. This is all for now. I I wish I could post CS:GO gameplay, but yeah, guys, this is C12 Designs, and I'm out. Peace.